What's up guys, uh, Sio Fantasia here, and uh, needless to say, it's been a while since I've done any Allegro tutorials, so I figure I guess I'll get back to them and make some more videos. Um, one thing I'd like to mention though is that uh, in transitioning from from before and now, I've I've made some mo a move between code, uh, Dev C++ and code blocks. So I'm now using code blocks instead of Dev C++ because uh, Dev C++ isn't uh, supported anymore, and code blocks is, and it has uh, new features and lots of um, lots of tools to help you debug and to manage your project more. Um, more neatly and more compact. So um, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to download code blocks and where to get it. You just go to internet here, and then you want to go to codeblocks.org, and then you're going to go to downloads and download the binary release, and then you want to get code blocks 10.05 with uh, the min w setup min w setup go to either one of these mirrors and download and after that then it's it's you just save it and run the executable and um, once you install um, then you should have code blocks and um, this is the new IDE this is what we'll be making our projects on from now on um, code blocks is um, it's easy to use relatively relatively easy to use and um, the good news is that you can actually import your projects from Dev C++ into code blocks so I thought that was that was rather advantageous um, so uh, that that's that's code blocks for you it's it's nice it's robu robust and just to um, just to show you what it looks like, this here it is. So in the next uh, video, we're gonna I'm gonna show you how to uh, create a project in Code Blocks and in, and compile it. Although it's not um, as much different as it is from Dev C++, but just to give you a little a little primer since it has been a while. Um, so thanks. Watch my next video.